You're on the red carpet at the Paley Fest, and this is the Bucks. It just keeps getting crazier and crazier, I think. It's terribly exciting. For people to like basically look at you and say, you're part of TV history now, it's very flattering. It definitely, I think, reinvigorates us to go back and keep doing the best job that we can do. I didn't really realize what was going on until we went to Paley Festival the first year. And I realized that everybody in the audience had flown in from all over the country. You look out into that audience of like two <laughs> diehard fans, and you're just like, wow. It makes it all real. There'll be about 25 of our cast on stage as opposed to just like six. We all get together and it's like a little reunion. How hard was it to master the southern accent? You literally get off that plane and you, you step into this wall of heat and everything just slowed. <laughs> and it wasn't until I did that that I realized why Nelson takes three minutes to get four words out. <laughs> it's really hard to answer, tell me a little bit about your character if you can't answer it. I honestly don't know what I'm allowed to say. Well, I know that there's not a lot I can talk about, for sure. I've heard that Godric's gonna be back this season. Do we know how, why, who, when? I know we how do. and why. We do. <laughs> <laughs> gotten to listen to what Alan's been saying yet, and usually that's what I take my cues. Any new characters being introduced? Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I have to sort of wait and see what kind of questions they'll ask. If they ask specific questions about what's going to happen, I'll say I, we can't really tell you that. How did he lose his memory? Um, aliens well, came from space, <laughs> <laughs> and they erased him. <laughs> You know, it's pretty thrilling to be up there with so many talented people and to be part of that. Feels good. I mean, the show is as big as it is because of the fans. What's the weirdest thing fans have asked you to do since you've been on the show? I have been asked to leave messages for, like, guys come up to me and say, will you speak to my wife as Bill? It's going to get me so late later. <laughs> <laughs> I've done that occasionally. <laughs> You've been buzzed. <laughs>